the scenes, behind the lines, inside the stories others won't tell. The Morning Insiders. A new law in Skokie takes effect this morning, ordering everyone to wear masks in stores. States and cities around the country are contemplating implementing the very same thing. Morning Insider Tim McNicholas spoke to an Illinois lawmaker who's pushing for a statewide mandate here. It was a simple trip to Mariano's in Lakeview. It was last Sunday, yes. Shopper Jane Conran noticed more than the produce. I saw people without gloves or masks. We decided to check it out and found some, but not all employees wore masks. Cloth masks are not required in Chicago, but the CDC and the governor recommend wearing them. How about this Walgreens down the street? Masks on most workers, but again, not everyone. And this jewel in Roscoe Village, the same deal. Plenty of shoppers without masks too. But any kind of face covering, protects other people. State Rep Mark Batnick recently wrote a letter to Governor Pritzker saying face covering should be a requirement for customers and workers. In my opinion, we're not doing a good enough job of uh, protecting our citizens now. And if, if we mandate it for all stores, I just think people will be more comfortable with it. Batnick says it should at least be a rule across the Chicago area, the city of Los Angeles, and now the villages of Skokie and Glenview all mandate masks in stores for customers and workers. Now, that doesn't mean you need an N95 mask. The CDC says cloth face coverings are fine because the N95s are still needed for medical workers and first responders. Well, it may not necessarily protect you, but it protects other people. Governor Pritzker says he'll consider requiring it. You know, look, anything that we can do going forward that, uh, that will, you know, protect people and at the same time make it more likely that we can have slightly, you know, different conditions for stay at home, uh, better conditions, you know, is, is a good move. The governor of Rhode Island signed an executive order this week saying stores must require and provide face covers for employees. A Jewel Osco spokesperson says the company has given masks and gloves to employees and they encourage them to wear them. Tim McNicholas, CBS 2 News. We also reached out to Mariano's and Walgreens, but we have not heard back yet. At several of the other Walgreens that we did visit, every employee did have a mask on. In Glenview and Skokie, Jules says they've posted signs informing customers that they must wear masks.